Margaret mentioned earlier, she started with Prudential on October 17, 1983, 26 years ago. And we are all very familiar with the Prudential, Susan. And Susan, many of your customers have um, shared their satisfaction as you help them with a variety of different things, whether it's been an agent helping them to understand all the policies in a family portfolio, or helping a customer find a missing premium payments, or just lending an ear to a customer, share stories of a loved one, and then assisting them by ensuring that Prudential fulfilled our promise to pay the proceeds of the issue. something very important. So we thank you very much for the calm and a helpful manner that you brought to all of us and uh, for serving our customers. And we truly enjoyed working with you. And I know that all of you here as a management, we all appreciate you very much. Now, all of us know the daytime, Susan. <laughs> but there is another side. And I'm sorry, Susan, but we really must share that little did we all know that while Susan was patiently helping our customers in any way possible, she was also leading a double life. <laughs> In addition to helping our customers, Susan has actually been spotted helping animals of all shapes and sizes, and we have heard these sounds in the background coming from her house. <laughs> and as disturbing as this may be, we have completed some investigative work, and here is what we found. I'm so excited, I can't wait. I brought these newspapers, it's what wouldn't fit the email in the back. You know, I can always use them, extra papers, that's just great. I can use them all the time. Thank you so much for coming over. Oh, I can't wait, I'm all excited. Oh, I know, Mark, yes! I can't wait to see Mark with his tight end, I mean the tight end. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'd be glad to help you with that. Good ownership statement. <laughs> 